All right. Oh, yawning. Wow. All right, I'm back with story mode, and we're gonna pick Peacock. Peacock. See what this crazy bitch's story is. Luduk Hive meet Peacock Lab 8 Magnum Ops Opus. So this is Project Peacock. I've read the papers, but now, nah, but I'm embarrassed to say that I can barely follow them. I'll explain. Project Peacock is equipped with not one, but two synth synthetic parasites. Lab Zero, uh oh, has created one other like her, but more. Extreme methods were required to complete the synchronization. Two synth synthetic parasites? Regulating the soul contamination must be difficult. Indeed, but with proper the theonite balance, I think we can graft even more onto future subjects. The Argus, Argus, <laughs> yeah, pre-order your shit online and then go and pick it up in the store. System not only lets her see everything, but the eyes also generate powerful Z rays and the precise wavelength needed to dis drop, disrupt the Skullgirl's essence. Cool. Hey, Gramps, shut it. I'm fucking busy. <laughs> what a bitch. I smoke cigars all day. The Avery unit is admittedly a bit less well understood. We designed it to be a special link between her body and Lab 8's vast underground arsenal, but she's doing things with it I never imagined possible. Seriously, Doc, shut it. It's getting to the good part. To think that poor mutilated orphan I found may be the one to defeat the Skullgirl once and for all. Yo, pops, I said cram it. <laughs> oh no, he's got his thumbs around my eyes. Oh wow, he really did? Shit. Hey, hey, listen. Oh, Squawk, wake up, Peacock. The Cyanite Resonance Detector is picking up a huge reaction downtown. It's her boss, the Skurgle is on the move. Hot damn, put some coffee on and give me a... Give me a what? I have no idea. <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. <laughs> nice. Now we're styling and profiling. Ready everyone? It's time to paint the town red. With their own blood. Psst, Avery? So, did the boss take a bath or what? And what does she brush her teeth with anyway? Metal polish? <laughs> I think a bath and her usual morning routine were implied. But they aren't something the audience needs to see. Hot 2D fighting! What the fuck? This is the weirdest shit. Do I know you? You don't. I don't know why I did that, but it worked. It's AI, they won't block that. They'll block the first bit and think, ooh, I can move now, and then not block the second bit. A pun loving cat. Here we go. Ow. Ow. Stop hitting me, pun loving cat. 
Yo, get fucked up, bro. What? Thought that would work? Ow. OTG, bitch. Yeah. That's what I like to see. Ladies and gentlemen, it's All right. Delightful. Man, who are all these poses getting between me and the skull girl? Don't they know who I am? I was built. I was built to beat them. The sooner I get done with that skull girl, skull school. I keep saying school. Skull girl. The sooner we can get back to watch glorious Annie sympathy symphony of star stuff. Yeah, I gotta get back to watch wrestling. I heard Beowulf's coming out of retirement. Squawk! Hold it, everyone. We've got a message coming in from Dr. Avian. Come in, peacock. To betray us. Slouch under attack. The duck is in trouble. We're too late. Whoever it is really did a number on the lab. Practicat. Did you hear that? I think I heard Dr. Alvin. Alvin. Oh my god, you're beat up pretty bad. Dr. Alvin, who did this to you? Lab Zero. Valentine. Betrayed us. She lets the skull girl in. Which way did they go? They fled to no Lily. Follow, but make sure the others are safe. I know you can't protect everyone. I know you can't. <laughs> I'm dead. He's gone, boss. Guys, get ready. Pissing me off is the last mistake those idiots will ever make. Alright, then we put on a dog mask and go, Brrr! Squawk! I see her, boss. The skull girl is right over the door. Wait, it can't be. Yo, you're a bitch. Mer Mari? She's the skull girl? I'm sorry, my child, but you're All right. <laughs> Let's go. Yo, peacock double. Woo. I am the superior peacock. Ow, ow, ow. Yo, for real, son. You will not beat me in a ranged fight, I promise. Oh my god. I'm trying to rush in with like a character that's not meant to rush in. Oh no, I might actually lose this one, I need to stop rushing down. That is not an effective playstyle. No! From the sky! Try again, kid. Try- fuck that. Fuck that, I'm so salty. That should not have happened. Oh, you know what I'm starting out with. A 
I've got combos. Don't even, don't even fuck with me. Oh god, it's like I'm fighting like a worse version of me. Like, doing all the gay shit that I would do. Ridiculous. I'm gonna get sh Oh, dude, that bomb just walked right past me, just waddling. Just waddled right past me. Didn't even give a shit. Hello, nurse. Nice place you got here, by the way. Love, I ate all my weapon finally rises. It'll be doubled, but don't worry. I'll be fitting you with a toe tag shortly. So why did you do it? Both of our labs are supposed to be working together to destroy the skull girl, and you lead her right to us. I won't explain my reason to a child, but can't just start that having his work, and that's what you really think we're gonna let you walk out of your life, Ness? I don't think you have a choice. Let me mud about you shit. Oh damn, she pretty hot. I admit, you were almost an interesting opponent, but you're nothing more than garbage, infected by Alien's philosophy of weakness. Double, it's time Lab 8's final experiment came to an end. Squawk will show you weakness, lady. We're gonna murderize you! Down to die, traitor! Yes, that's what they said, we reached straight the hill to the dark. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so we're against Nurse and Double. Alright. Let me mode about your tits. Let me mode about your face. What? Ow. Ow. 